Hello everyone, welcome back to the Feel Good Gaming channel. Today I'm talking about how to play the Traffic Escape mobile game. This game is really, really fun and addictive. Um, so yeah, normally when you load a game, I guess the first time you will get to see the screen collect like a daily reward. And so I'm just gonna claim this. And then before I jump straight to play the actual game, what I like to do is something called this multiplier here so if you click on that and what it does it basically multiplies the in-game reward uh, trophy that you get when you win a level so to basically claim this you have to watch a video ad so once you watch the ad this is the pop-up screen you're gonna see you just tap to claim that and that basically runs for 10 minutes okay so we're gonna go ahead and play this level so i can show you guys how to play this game now there are two things you got to consider you got to consider uh the where the arrow on top of the car is pointing to and does that car have an obstruction in front of it if it doesn't you can just go ahead and simply tap on that now we can see a rack over here and we can see a bulldozer over here racks and bulldozers get along uh normal cars do not move racks i'm gonna show you exactly what happens so there you go the car does not move also, you got to consider making sure that you look at the amount of moves you have and try to make sure you, every move counts. Now, the bulldozer can help get rid of this rack. So what we're going to do is we can use the hints uh, and the boosters over here. So for the sake of this video, I'm going to show you guys what they do. So you have the bulb sort of icon here. So if you tap on that, what it does, um, if you tap on anywhere on the screen, it basically tells you which car to move next so let's tap on that car then you have the helicopter option and when, when you simply tap on that and then you tap any vehicle to remove so we can just tap on this it basically picks up the massive truck and get and basically gets rid of it so those are those are the sort of boosters you get in the game and whilst you're also playing this level uh it's always good to sort of look at the um daily sort of task uh quest that is there so you have the uh, complete task in 11 hours so if you use helicopter three times you basically get five star so that's pretty cool now um so yeah as you guys already know how to play the game so i'm just gonna go ahead and play this level um there we go da -da. Mm -mm. Now, now the bulldozer has cleared the rack. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much how you sort of play the individual levels. And here we are, we have a free gift. Let's open that up. Oh wow, we got a one hint and we got a couple of coins. You can watch a video and uh, collect more rewards. Um, but you also have the Wheel of Luck, which is just here. I like the Wheel of Luck because again, you gotta watch a video. So for the sake of this video, we are going to watch the video ad. So you basically, and so when you watch a video, this is what it does. And here we are, we're able to claim 250 coins. You can multiply this reward by basically watching another video. But for now, we're just gonna press the claim. If you wanna win more things on the Wheel of Luck, you just watch the video. The moment that the video comes back, immediately the wheel spins. Um, and then of course, you also have your daily quest. So this goes into your daily quest when you spin the Wheel of Luck twice. Uh, you get to win five star points here Now the daily quest section is just this little notebook with a pen thing here and On it with the daily quest. Yeah, so you can actually watch a video and get five points and that gets added to your It gets accrued over here and if you watch the video three times you get 15 Quadruple that you get 30 and so on until you get 50 and then of course you gotta follow these little tasks down here so if you use your hints three times you get to claim this option spin the wheel of luck twice as we noticed before you get this option and you just basically claim that and all these stars get accrued over here and you collect the gifts um, you also have the uh, bronze league so as you play along guys you get some points and they kind of double up 
So it's always good when you have the times two option there. It means it doubles your reward uh, and you basically get to have some cash and climb up the ranks. Um, in terms of the ranks, I don't know if they are actually like live or uh, are they like bots? I'm not sure. Um, you have the level race option. So for the sake of this video, I'm going to do it so you guys can see what it looks like. So we're just going to watch the video ad. And so here we are. So now we have to start playing. We have literally one hour to be 30 levels and get our car to the first line over here because it's a race so you press the continue and of course you come back here and play then we also have the challenge mode over here the challenge mode has two options extreme and nightmare so for the sake of this video and we're gonna play the extreme and nightmare by the way this cost in-game coins so here we have eight thousand nine hundred forty-five coins to play this game is gonna play this challenge mode here the extreme is going to cost us 200 coins so we're just going to press that you press the play now the challenge mode is very critical you have many different things happening you have the different obstacles you have these sort of like trucks and this base this trucks here they help you to get rid of the the rocks on the road the bulldozers i think that's what they're called um normal cars cannot get rid of the rocks so you got to be very careful of the moves you make so we're gonna go ahead and just play this level oh this is the first one over here so that's done second one third one fourth one da, da, da. there we go we use the bulldozer to clear that area we can use the bulldozer there uh let's see we can clear that Clear that. Da, da, da. Let's see. This is going that way, so that's gonna be tricky. We're gonna need a bulldozer to clear that. There we go. And then we can go ahead and clear that. Now we have the last rock over here. We can't move it. We can't just tap the car in because if you try to if we try to hit it with a the car there you go that's what you get it does not move so we press the bulldozer over here clear that and clear that job done so that's how to play the uh the challenge mode um and we're gonna look at the extreme one now just to see what it looks like okay so now we're gonna do the nightmare version i have never played the nightmare before of course the nightmare cost a lot more to play <laughs> 600 coins so make sure you save your coins guys let's see what it looks like okay so we have a pedestrian we have bulldozers and rocks okay this looks pretty easy i just gotta wait for oh yeah you also have the uh the red light green light option so of course you got a red light stop green light you can go i think that's <laughs> pretty self-explanatory uh so yeah we're just gonna wait for the pedestrian to go yes yes what else do we have now we can press the bulldozer because the light is green so that's good uh yes we can go uh, let me see yes we can go yes. da, da, da. Uh, let's have a look yeah. Clear that. Clear that. Okay. Funny enough, it felt like the nightmare mode was a little easier. I don't know if it was because I was just starting the nightmare level. Um, let's go to next. Of course, guys, um, this game has an ad after you finish each level. So each level you play generally has an ad, which is not bad because at least you get to actually complete the game and not have ads appear in between so that's that's a good thing to be aware of uh let's see in terms of our race where are we we've only win one two races so that means even when you play in the challenge mode uh, uh if you when you play them so of course the amount of levels you play counts or if you play the normal gameplay mode as well it gets added here as well so 
That's a good thing actually, I didn't know that. So if you play the normal mode, including the challenge, it all gets accrued, um, accrued over here. So that's a good thing to be to bear in mind. But of course, I'll recommend you use this one to try to win as much because obviously these levels are a little easier. Um, so I don't know, I think that's pretty much it. I don't know if I've mentioned the shop. Yeah, so you have the shop option where you get to watch a video to collect free chests. So for the sake of this video, we are going to do the, just that. We're going to watch a video to open a chest. Okay, so yeah, so we watched a video to open a free chest. Um, then the next time we can do that is in six hours time. That's absolutely fine. And of course, if you were able to buy yourself uh, uh, 10 tickets, basically you can use the tickets to, as it says here, you can use the tickets to basically skip ad. So you don't have to watch a video, you just use the ticket and you can open a free chest and collect free in-game rewards where they are available because you have the ticket option. Um, again, that requires real currency to do that. And yeah, so the other option here that you have is you have the icon here just on the left. You tap on that and you are able to change your profile name as well as choose your character here. You can choose the frame. You can also choose the frame color, sorry, the frame color. And you, also choose, you can also choose the icon. Uh, you have different animals here, so to sort of suit your preference, I uh, choose the lion because I feel a little bit like a lion. Um, don't ask me why. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. Um, if you guys have any questions, simply just comment below this video. Again, I will have the link in the description of this video pointing to, or to the page on my website where I talk about how to play this game and just some um, easy hints, tips as well. But again, the game is pretty easy to play, so you probably don't need it, but we, we got that on the website as well. So um, yeah, so that's pretty much it, guys. Um, hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's been helpful to you. Much. Um, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now. So the next thing to consider when playing Traffic Escape game, um, if you wanted to, you have the uh, the skins option, which is just this little paintbrush here. You tap that, and what that does, um, you can basically choose any car that you want. You can choose the yellow. You can, if you have some coins, you can buy the more sporty looking cars. Um, if you want to pay real money, which you can as well. Again, I don't recommend you should because they don't give you any boosters in a game it doesn't give you extra power-ups or anything like that it's just literally just skins um to uh, just giving you a better looking car then you have the basically the sort of smoke trail that comes out of the back of the car so you have the uh, the disco star you have the free option which is the this one you have the other ones but it seems a lot of the ones on this size are premium ones again it's just skins then you have the sort of decorating the sort of uh this background you have the rural so you have like flowers and grass you have the main blank one uh, just the standard ones and of course as you level up you get to unlock more uh more fields basically and more sort of smoke trails and other cars as well but again, bear in mind guys, these are just skins, so it's literally nothing else. 